Well, I tried to, um... Up there. Oh, there was... I tried to make that so that was a temporary companion, so he'd be a pet and come with me. Years of humanoid history, elves, dwarves, humans, and but I failed, and so he just ran off on his own instead of staying with me. That's okay. Don't need him anyways. Do you think I was a thrall? We carry mind flayer parasites. Unless we escape, unless we are cleansed, our bodies and minds will be tainted and twisted. Within days, we will be geich, mind flayers. Uh, who are you? I did not choose any of those options that caused that, those clipping issues. But yes, those are supposedly fixed. I didn't check. See you, Becky. Uh, we need to figure out where we are. do nothing until we escape. That must be our priority. First, we exterminate the imps. Then we find the helm and take control of the ship. We will address the matter of a cure for this infection once we reach the material plane. Okay, let's do it. But first we fight the imps. Alright, so let's turn this on. Run up and hit this guy. Bloody work. Four damage. Joran, you suck. Just kidding. I definitely expected more than four damage. Okay, we gotta fix Lazel's bar here before we do anything else. Throw, dash, disengage, help, improvised weapon, ranged attacks, lacerate, boar rush, pommel strike, and then also throw these two things down here, and then I think we're set. Slide that over one. All right, lock that back up. Okay, she's set. Uh, let's go run over and hit this guy. Let my name be known. Oh. Gosh, I rolled so poorly. Can I take him out with a pommel strike? Well, at least I dazed him. Um, 1d10, and we rolled... Oh, I guess she got to re-roll it. 1d10, we rolled a 2. 
Come on, Lazel. All right. Well, I guess there's miss. Good. Fireball. Okay, one damage is fine. There we go. That's what we were looking for. Last time. Oh, did I lose my concentration? Okay, no, I guess it's the same. Yeah, you, okay, use my wisdom modifier. 1d8 bludgeoning. Okay. No, I think that's right. Because otherwise it would be... Oh, we're, okay, I guess I can't really tell. Oh, I guess it would be 1d8 plus 0, because it would be using my strength instead of my wisdom modifier. Okay, so we're... Yeah, that's still correct. Time to strike. There we go. Critical miss! Five? Just five? Swift and lethal. There's the rest of it. You Hooray! We did it. We got through our first fight, guys. We did it. What's hiding here? We got through our first fight. I'm so proud of us. Gold, thank you. Don't mind if I do. Here we go. Oh. Oh. I feel better. Yep, we'll use the restoration pod. We need to get out before it's too late. Hey, an extra potion. I'm sure that'll come in handy. <laughs> Through the sphincter. Back. Touch nothing without knowing its purpose. Okay, Lazel, calm down. I'm gonna read it first. Another or not. Wow. I'm so good at intelligence checks. Oh, I made him fight me. Well, okay. That just means more experience. Uh, what do you mean, not enough movement? I can't hit. Yeah, it's because I surely I can hit him. Hit him from right there. Just kidding. I will ascend. I will not know failure. One shot. Well done, Lazel. Ouch. Dude, the acid splash was really not necessary. That was really rude. Really, really rude. Swift as my feet. I'm gonna use the restoration pod again. Okay, who's yelling over here? You! Get me out of this damn thing! We have no time for stragglers. Yeah, but she could help us fight. The 
console appears dormant. Look for a switch. The mechanisms are complete. What? Oh. Rocket must power this thing. That, yeah, he's back and he brought a friend. The one that I failed to make my friend is angry at me. This might be interesting. Um, can I think I can get close enough to hit him? Might need to jump. Give me a little bit of a movement boost there. Let's go there. Let's knock you backwards. Hopefully knock you backwards. I did two damage and he saved. This is gonna hurt. Let's take a pot shot at this guy while we run up. Well, again, not great. Okay, well, at least they're rolling ones. Uh, nope, we gotta turn this on. Use our wisdom for attack instead of strength. There we go. Nice hit. Another miss. Nope. Switch back to this. Taste my fury. Nice hit. It's on a short rest. Oh, the restoration pod counts as a short rest. That's why I got that. And damage, nice hit. I think that's, is that my maximum roll? Close to it. I will ascend. Okay, this should finish it off. There we go. Big hit. Okay. One more time to the restoration pot. What's right here? Oh, another manuscript? Faint images appear in your mind. A brain, a get Yankee warrior, and centuries of darkness. Necklace? Sure. Pick up somebody's necklace. Oh. You guys didn't have anything on you right now, you did. Ooh, there's a key. That's probably important. How many hosts of these gay infected? Dazed woman is trapped inside the pod. She doesn't notice you. No traps, keys. Two more potions. Good. A thrall that has an eldritch rune. This might unlock those controls next nice. to the pod. Could mean anything. I'm so good at Arcana. Let's see what happens when we push this button. As you place your hand on the pod, you hear something. A presence connected to the pod, commanding the person inside to change. My bad. Pull of a lever. How? If we are not purified, this may be our fate. Strange. Is this to be our fate? The newborn mind flayer stares at you, weak and dazed. Soul appears dormant. The 
console well, look, it fits. to life. But what is its purpose? Will it free the captain or transform her like that other unfortunate? All right, one second. Take a short break here. I'll be right back. Okay, sorry. We're back now. Uh, well, let's try another Arcana check. But I am a big dum dum, so not very good at Arcana checks. Hey, we actually passed one. On the number. The pulsing glow and organic lines of the device make it seem more like a beating heart than a machine. This device is different from the one that caused the other captive to transform. Perhaps it will open the nearby pod. Okay, let's do it. I place my hand in the console. Suddenly, you feel a hideous squirming in your head. The parasite. Then discomfort fades, and another sensation washes over you. Connection. Authority. I have a plus three to my wisdom rolls. I literally can't fail this unless I roll a one. Whew, that's close. You feel the biomechanical brain of the console process your command and yield to it. A shiver runs across your mind. You feel sated. <laughs> Kidneys, they fixed that. No more, uh, no more, uh, sorcerer gnome donkeys. Thought I was done for. Woo! All right. Listen, until all of my kids are sleeping, this is a dong free zone. is mixed with wariness because you have a gith with you. <laughs> you keep dangerous company. Wait, so both your height and the other measurement are 311? <laughs> That's fun. They do really like to take away all the fun, McNoosh. Um, oh, one is three and one is 11. Okay, yeah. Three, three feet and 11 inches? I'm on board now. <laughs> uh, you got a problem with Gith Yankee? Not that Gith have a problem with everyone else. But there's more important matters right now. Okay. Survive. Shadow Heart. Let me come with you. We can get off this ship and watch each other's backs along the way. off my knee. I'm like, yes, bards can do that. <laughs> it's kind of wild what bards can do. Uh, yeah. I really like the that part about this game. You can, if you have, you know, the right combination of skills and everything, you can, uh, they basically created paths for you to do just about anything, which is really fun. Uh, did you feel what I felt just before we were in each other's heads? I did. It must be because of those parasites they put in us. But that'll have to wait. Are we going to help each other or not? All right, I guess. I'm Joran. Shadowheart. One moment. Shadowheart, what are you trying to hide from me? What's it's that? Nothing. Trust me. Enough of this chatter. Doubt. The helm. Now. Oh, hang on. I got something for that. Lead on. Wait, where's my emotes? Oh, never mind. Uh... Yeah. 
Yeah, see, we got new emotes. I got some Baldur's Gate 3 themed emotes. Okay, Shadowheart, what do you do? Hmm. You're a cleric. Uh, and we need to fix your toolbar. Jump, dip, hide, throw, dash, disengage, help, improvised weapon, attack, attack. Uh, we'll put the, oops, no, cancel that. We'll put all of our, we'll put our buffs here. And our attack jigger is there. Oh, this is also an attack. Okay, attacks, buffs, heals, and other things. Yeah! McNoosh is very mad. <laughs> uh, and then we'll throw a potion or a vivify down there. need more room for spells. Lock it. All right. right. What now? Uh, oh, there's a backpack here. What's in the box? Another step forward. Oh, and then the key that I found. Does that open this? <gasps> it does. We got an onyx and 12 gold. can't really take a whole lot of credit for the uh, for the emotes they were um, we are nearing the helm. once inside do as I say they were part of oh gosh what were they part of they were part of the um, were they in the I think they were in the deluxe edition pack there was something there was something that I got like from Larian um, that had those in there. <laughs> Guys, I think he's dead. Five damage and stunned him. That's a good first turn for Mr. Mind Flayer. Okay, my turn. First off is this. And then can I reach anybody to hit them? Yeah, let's try and take out the imp first. Yeah, got him in one shot. Nice job. Cool, you have stuff on hand. I don't think these guys have anything. They do not. Zell. Alright, can I daze him at least? Yeah, there we go, he dazed him. that I've got. Concentrate. Yeah, you hit him. Nice job. Okay, now we just gotta get down here. Can 
I can reach that. Oh, I can't quite reach it. Um, okay. I will ascend. On the move. Eh, not too bad. Can I reach it? Nope, can't reach it. spells. I should have prepared Bless so that I could bless him as well to try and keep him alive. Alright, now we just kind of get over here so that we can reach the transponder and then we take pot shots at this guy. <laughs> we don't have too much hope of hitting him, but we're going to hope that he stays, along long enough, or stays alive long enough to tank him and we can whittle him down because I want to take his sword. That would be, yeah, definitely can't do that in combat. Nor should you be able to. Um, I kind of want to get behind him. What if I jumped? Does that give me enough movement to sneak behind him? Because I don't think he'll hit me while that guy's alive. And I can disengage or run away if I need to. Okay, let's uh, try it. I can put a bleed on. Oh, we did it! Nice job, Lazel. I need to stay alive. That's not good. If this ship hits the ground, we're dead. Oh, that's gonna hit all of them, though. If I just make it explode right there so he maybe falls down. Ah, he saved. We'll try it. Oh, nice hit. I really want to take his sword. left he's got a hundred I don't know if this is gonna work um, can I do this maybe okay well I healed him seven <laughs> Sure. Got to move. 